Ooh, hello there, my fellow Scar Mechanics. Good times. It's Scar here, bringing you Scrap Mechanic, a brand new sandbox style game where you create vehicles using your imagination and your technical know how. So, we're down here where we have our load game, new game, character, all sorts of cool little options, but the game is currently in beta, and I do have to say the game runs incredibly well, and there's very few, if at all, bugs that I've even found. And what we're gonna do here is we're gonna jump into new game, and at the moment, there is only creative. So, looking at this, I have the hopes that there may be a survival uh, aspect eventually. So we'll click that, and what we have here, we can put down our world name, and we're gonna call this Sky Industries. And we're gonna go with Terrain. I always prefer to go over Terrain, especially like in Minecraft, that we're gonna build houses. It just adds more character to our builds. And got our settings and our create button, and let's get this underway. So. As you can see, we have a young Santa Claus to our right, and these are our characters, and young Mrs. Claus over in the vehicle there. And uh, this is really cool. So you use your kind of your imagination to create vehicles, something that we love in Minecraft, and we can kind of uh, take it into the next level here with a lot of robotical things that, you know, we're never so great with those things in Minecraft, but we'll learn here. We'll start at the ground floor and learn like we should have done back in the day with redstone. All right, so screw up mechanic. And yeah, if you guys want to read this, you can pause the video and I pretty much got it. There we go. And welcome to Sky Industries. Oh, hello. Oh, never seen those before. Anyway, let's go over here to the flatland and let's take a look at our hotbar. So, similar survival games have a hotbar of this kind. And the first thing in slot one is our mechanical book. So let's open up our book here. And this looks like a Tinker's Construct, if you will. Look at the beautiful detail, all of the details that we need to learn. I mean, I wish more games had something like this. You know, just the, just the basics. Just kind of get, you know, just enough to kind of understand the basic fundamentals of the game. And then just kind of go from there. That's what I love here. Just some real basic information. And uh, as you can see, how to play all this good stuff here. And I'm uh, moving in how to make a basic vehicle. And that's where we're gonna to start today. We're gonna to follow the plan kind of uh, to a T, and then we're gonna put our scar charm upon the vehicle at the end there. So as you can see, this is how we're gonna start. We're gonna create this little platform, then we're gonna add a nice cushy chair, a little engine, got ourselves some little uh, Frisbee discs like that. We're gonna stick those on our wheels, and then we're gonna use our, I think that's the thing we use to rotate the wheels and connect thingamabobs. It looks like something out of Ghostbusters. We'll talk about that later. And as you can see, that's it. And then we can go on eventually in future episodes, more detail and all that good stuff. So let's start our vehicle. So what we're gonna do over here is we're gonna go over to our little uh, forklift lifty guy. So we're gonna put our little lifty guy, let's do it actually in this field so we don't uh, have all the terrain in the way. There we go. Look at that, see? Once we're done making vehicles, we're gonna go look for ghosts. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. We, we can't get too crazy. So uh, basic controls, inventory is I. I'm gonna bind that to E or, or my mouse eventually. And then as you can see, this is uh, similar to a creative menu where you have all of the possibilities of vehicle, mechanical devices, and all sorts of cool stuff. Look at this little pipes and most importantly, potted plants for your decorations and toilet paper. You do not wanna get going on your vehicle and realize that you don't have any toilet paper. So that's very important. So we got that all set up and ready to go. And I think we're just going to, so this is a metal block, heavy weight. I don't know exactly of the weight differences in vehicles. I haven't got that far, but we'll get there eventually. Uh, I think we're just gonna do stone. So let's jump back out of here, as you can see. And then what we're gonna, oh, hello. Um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna jump over here. And as you can see, the, uh, the plane is going vertical at the moment. So we're just gonna drag that up to about there. And then I'm just gonna back up like a so. And as you can see, look at that. Pretty awesome, pretty awesome. See how intuitive that is? Like, look at that. I'm just really amazed that this is a brand new game and it is so detailed. So with our arrow keys, we can raise and lower our little lift. There we go, beautiful. So we're gonna start working here. So I'm gonna start about here and I'm going to jump on the other side and I'm just gonna put another block right there. Looking good, looking good. And then I'm just gonna jump on this side. And as you can see, I'm gonna put that this about a right about there. Awesome, beautiful. And then I'm gonna jump, oh, hello. Um, then I'm gonna put that right there. How are we doing so far? Taking a little inventory. I'm liking it, I'm liking it. Watch this. <laughs> I love this thing, this is too much fun. Okay, um, oh, hello, your big hammer again. I, 
don't know what you do, but I'm sure it's awesome. So, you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I'm just gonna make this one block wider. There we go. Nice, nice. This will give us some more options in the future. There we go. Those little silos are very spooky. Okay, beautiful. All right. So, next thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna raise this up a little bit. There we go. And then we're gonna sneak down here. Oh, not yet, Mr. Tire. Not yet. We're gonna stick another one of these guys right there like we did before. And then I'm gonna run one more layer across the back like that. So see, see, it's just kind of finding the ways you want it. There we go. And I'm gonna sneak on over here. Place two more blocks like a so. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put our little Frisbee. So I'm gonna put a little Frisbee right there and put it right there. All right, so that gives us the ability to turn. So we'll take a look at that in a little bit later. So then I'm gonna place another one of these guys on top. Come on, come on, there you go. I'm gonna place another one right there. And place these guys along there, looking good, looking good. All right, so Frisbees again. Frisbees for everyone, there we go. Put those all along there and you're probably getting a good idea now how things are starting to work. And we're gonna place our tires like a so. Looking good, looking good. Sneak through the back. There we go. So one of the things that really appeals to me with this game is I really want to make a garage, like a really cool garage. You know, I think we do our best here making vehicle or, you know, making structures. I mean, not so much vehicles. So I think uh, I think we're going to make some cool little structures to go along with this. OK, so we've got kind of the basic setup. So now what we're going to do is we're going to pull this bad boy out. And what we're going to do is we're going to connect this. So we're going to connect that to there. Looking good, or is it to here? Eh, I think it's actually to here. Anyway, I think it doesn't matter. Okay, so I'm just gonna raise this up just a smidge. There we go. And then what we're gonna do is we're going to take this. So we're gonna grab onto that green little bubble and we're gonna bring it down here. So connecting that, we now have the ability to turn our vehicle. So our steering wheel will now turn this. So we'll get to the rotation in just one moment. We're gonna take the other end here and we're gonna stick it on there. Looking good, looking good. Next thing we're going to do is we're gonna give this thing some power. So we're gonna take this and we're gonna drag it to these Frisbees like so. Look at that. How are we doing so far, you guys following? That's good, that's good. There we go. And then as you can see, first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna make sure our tires are rotating this away. So clockwise, that's what we want. We want these things to be rotating in a clockwise fashion. So we're gonna check the other side, make sure they're, ooh, hello, you're not correct. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna rotate that. See how we did that? See how we did that? You got these ones rolling like that. Looking good, looking good. Next thing we need to do, and sometimes I goof this up, a little dyslexic. So uh, we're gonna make sure when we turn our wheels, we're gonna be turning it in the right direction. So let's see, so if I turn, yeah, I think that's right. And we're gonna sneak on over here. We're gonna check this one real quick. And I think that's good, I think that's good. So next thing we do is I'm just gonna access my engine. And I'm just gonna give it a little power, not too much. As much as I wanna go up here, we're not gonna have any fun if we go up there because we'll end up with a broken leg and we don't want that. So we're gonna stay down about here because last time I powered that all the way up, I ended up in a tree and it was a whole thing. So I'm gonna take this away now. All right, I'm gonna put you away, jump in here and away we go. So here we go, my friends. Uh, oh, yep, 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 dyslexic. Oh gosh, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. The dyslexia just, it just never ceases to amaze me. Um, so we're just gonna put this like this. We're gonna make sure those are all so awesome. There we go. We're gonna move that one over. There. All right, we good. We're good. We're great. Awesome. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that movement right there. That's that's some precise, silky smooth movement. So we're just cruising around, taking a look at all the beautiful scenery. We got the giant silos over here, got a little rock pile. So I assume eventually within the game, like we talked about at the beginning, that we'll get, um, you know, different details and different things like that. Maybe a survival mode and stuff like that. More of a multiplayer situation would be really cool. Do races with friends. I think that would be a lot of fun. So let's take a look at our vehicle. Hello, Mr. Vehicle. I'm liking it so far. It's not bad, but let's jump into our inventory and let's try to add a little pizzazz to it. So one thing I do notice within the game is I don't see windshields. Do you see any windshields? Like I don't see those. So maybe that's something they could add eventually. Um, I feel like maybe the toilet paper is important. So let's um, let's, let's just let's just add some toilet paper. I mean, it's it's important. I feel like it's an important aspect of the vehicle just in case. You never know if you get outside of the realm of of your home. Okay, so let's get back to work here. So what I wanna do is just, just add a little more detail to the outside. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on here like so. So yeah, as you can see, get the little blocks on there like that. And I'm gonna drag this out over here. 
and I'm going to do the same over here. Now, what would you guys like to see from me with this game? Would you guys like to see any particular vehicle designs? I already have a couple design ideas for maybe like a fun kind of garage. So that's something I want to work on and just kind of learning some of the different details of the kind of the technical stuff I think will be kind of fun. I think that will be fun to kind of learn because that's not always our number one thing we did in Minecraft. And this game has a lot of similarities. I keep bringing that up because the game has its similarities to Minecraft. There we go, put that across there. And then let's see, I, I, like, I like this so far. I like this so far. I'm gonna put this across here like that. I'm gonna click in one more time. Oh, hello. So this is a great opportunity to show you guys how easy it is to take a block away. Just click it and it's gone. No, no, no fuss, no fuss. It's just completely gone. There we go. How are we doing so far? I'm doing good. Yeah, I like it. I like it so far. So now I'm just gonna, it's gonna kind of connect these pieces like that. There we go. Come in like so. And this is really basic. This is really basic for our first vehicle. There we go. Look at this thing. It's like a rocket ship. All right. Um, I'm gonna put these guys like that. Just giving a little tail fins. There we go. And then let's just put a little piece like that. And look at that. The thing's gotten a little style now. I'm loving it. Um, I just want to put these across there, it's kind of like a little rimmy thing, I suppose, something along those lines. Um, what about right down here? Let's see what we can do about cleaning this up a little bit. There we go. I'm loving it. Um, let's see. I would like to have a little bit more, maybe an end to it. Let's just put two more blocks like that. And um, I'm kind of loving this at the moment for our very first vehicle. Not bad, not bad at all. Here we go, looking good. Okay, um, let's see what we can do in the interior here. Let's see if we can just kind of freshen it up just a little bit, makes things feel a little bit more clean and well-designed. There we go, get those pieces along there, get that along there, there we go. And what can we do inside this little section? There's gotta be like a cool little kind of like engine or just some form of detail we can put in here besides a potted plant. Oh, oh, hello. I like you. Could we, where could we put you? Hmm. Let's see. Oh, oh, I wish this was, oh, it's too, too symmetrical. Let's just put it right there. Haha, -ha, there we go. Let's take a look at our inventory one more time. And what in the world is that? I, I didn't even know what that was. That, that's creepy. Okay, moving on. Um, I, uh, there's not a lot of detail. I'm just looking for that windshield or something to put in that center column there. Is there like a grill or something? A steel pallet. I don't know how big this is. If it was small, it would look cool like, oh yeah, hello, that's too big. That's, that's just, that's just gargantuan, my friends. Just gargantuan. Uh, what's this? This might be kind of cool. Let's uh, stick this on here. Oh, yeah. Aha, I like that. That looks cool. That looks cool. I like that a lot, actually. There we go. Just a little details. Just a little details. Oh. Yeah, let's take those off. Let's take those off of our hubcaps. Let's jump back over here. And let's see. Anything else awesome that we could put in here? Oh, hello. Let me put, why don't we put this in there? Let's put this in there. Does this go? Let's see. No, that looks goofy. No, nah, that looks goofy. Um, but anyway, I think that's pretty good for our first vehicle. We'll continue to look at all the details. Let's jump back in here and, oh yeah, it's like a little arrow. <laughs> oh, I love this thing. This thing is amazing and we're cruising along, cruising along. I wish this thing had a little bit more gas. Now, if anybody needs to use the restroom, I do have the toilet paper. So if anyone needs it, got it, it's ready to go. So we're cruising along. So we need to find a place to set up Scar Industries. And it does kind of look like just ahead that we have a nice flat land where we can create the uh, little house there. And so far, I'm loving this game. I want to get your guys' thoughts in the comments. Oh, oh, we can't make it. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're going down. We're going down. <laughs> I want to get your thoughts on the game so far. So leave me a comment. Let me know how you guys have liked the game so far and what you want to see in the future. There we go. All right, there we go. We got the speed. We got the speed. Aero car is underway. Uh, I think this is a great spot for Scar Industries. And well, guys, I hope you enjoyed today as much as I did creating this fun little vehicle. And until next time, we'll see you later. And don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Twitter.
and welcome back and look at the s'more house from above doesn't it look amazing with all the different landscaping elements coming together i think that looks really cool so as we tour the build here i would love it if you guys let me know what your favorite build within the project was